It's a dog bone there. You see that there around. Welded onto the bone practically. Some animal that was either slaughtered or murdered, whichever. So <clears throat> that's just soft as there, but see inside in the bone then around it so this would have been a hip joint you see it here it's all soft but it's right in with the bone there see so what happens is you have this like that so it would all be together Everything would be together there. So this is the way the hip would work then. You'd have it like that, working in place, walking like so, and everything is fine. But once you get a separation there just there where the ball meets the socket that's what gives arthritic pain and as we notice now that there's hip replacements in the country has gone very high so that is the way hip works basically like so once all that is together there but it comes away then and uh, bone just so basically what it is it's you ask yourself the question how have we so many hip replacements in the country and such like that and joint problems which would be something onto that as well so, they're not cannabis joint problems. So what's happening is, <clears throat> the fluoride is getting to this tissue that's holding the bone together. And that's what's causing a separation. And the gel inside here, within the socket and the pocket, weeps out. And that's what's causing these hip replacements. So, and if you want to look then, there, on what would be the laptop there. And that's having fluoride in our water. That's the side effects of fluoride. So it would be an idea for the present sit-in government <clears throat> it was ignored by the, pre the last government we know that and the previous one before that. So this is what fluoride causes to the human body and itself. So, as I say, it's just an animal there. The fluoride, it's such a toxic poison that it actually rots that and it creates a separation in the gel to be weeping out through here. 
they were a bit shiny and that's what creates problems in pain which is one of the reasons why our, our hospitals have a massive backlog in hip replacements so it would be a good idea to get the fluoride out of the water whatever minister is there at the moment as you can see this is what its fluoride is causing so Ireland has the highest cancer rate in Europe we're the only country in Europe that accepts this fluoridated fluoracilic acid in our drinking water so Irish water you're part of this as well you're supplying this water so you're liable as well as government giving us this um, toxic poison into our waters thanks very much for watching Thank <laughs> you.